What's up trainers? I am the Pokemon Trainer and today we are back with a brand new episode of my Pokemon Yellow walkthrough. As you can see, we have a Graveler, aka Boulder. Well, he's not the one and only the Boulder, but um, or the Boulder. But uh, yeah man, I'm excited, we're back. Um, we're almost ready to challenge the Elite Four. We gotta train up our guys. Um, but before we do that, we have a few more trainers that we have to uh, take on before we can start grinding. But we will get to that as soon as we're done healing up Bradley. As you can see, these potions don't <laughs> heal that much, only by 20. Alright, and what well, looks like maybe one more. There we go. Alright. And so now, we're going to go through this windy, narrow place, or bridge, I don't know. We're, like, we're on a mountain, it looked like, like a cliff, I guess. A little baby mountain. <laughs> Alright, here's Onyx, and hopefully Onyx will let us run away. Why do we switch out to Pikachu? Have we not learned anything from the when Ash battled Brock? The only reason he won was because of the, the sprinkler, and it had water on Onyx that, yeah. Only the Chosen can pass here. You sound like Gandalf. You shall not pass! <laughs> but yeah, back to the anime thing. Uh, I remember like Pikachu Thundershocked or something. Uh, there's like one of those sprinklers, like if there's ever a fire, like... I guess they go off and they squirt water all over, but yeah, and it got all over Onyx, the water, and Pikachu Thundershock to make him super weak, so, yeah, and we're gonna make this Kingler super weak because he's a water type Pokemon, yeah baby, so last night I ended up uh, recording live streaming actually on Twitch the new Sword and Shield game. Um, I didn't like how my audio came out so I think I'm gonna have to re re-record that one. I didn't get that very I didn't get this you know really far so it's okay to start over. Um, but yeah man it it was fun. I'm not gonna lie. I like how you could customize your character like they did in uh, X and Y. That was really awesome. I'm glad they brought that feature back because my my trainer looked really cool. Um, what else? Uh, that's pretty much it. Um, oh no, I, I lie. Uh, what else happened was yesterday was Rhyhorn Community Day. I ended up catching uh, two shinies, and my friend en ended up catching one. We traded traded each other. We didn't get. Um, you know, lucky Pokemon or anything, but the only th thing that happened was our Pokemon got one star instead of no star, so <laughs> not that much of a of an improvement, but um, it still learned the move um, Wreck Rock, I think it was. So, yeah, man. That was cool. I, I went the whole full three hours in the rain. I had an umbrella. It was raining. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get the shiny Rhyhorn. And I did, man. It was fun. Alright, that's how much you can tell I love Pokemon. Yeah, I just went three hours in the rain for some shiny Rhyhorn. I only got two. Um, I ended up evolving a couple of uh, uh, non-shiny ones as well because I had, like, I think a 93 IV Rhyhorn, which was my strongest, so I figured I'd take advantage of that. Um, and I'm hoping it's good in PvP. There was also a Arcanine raid going on um, near the park I was playing at, so me and my friend ended up uh, doing the Arcanine raid, and we we got it. And it's pretty cool because it, it knows like an electric attack for its fast attack, and then it knows flamethrower I think for its charge attack. And it was pretty good IVs. I don't, I don't remember at the moment what they were, but yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. Um, all right, we got a weeping bell up next. That means we're gonna have to switch. I hope we press yes, but looks like we didn't. A weeping bell. 
I guess our Dragonair is level 40. He still needs to a couple more levels till Dragonite. So we do have to train him. Uh, it's not looking good. The slam, let's see. The slam did that much. Okay. One more if we can survive this. Uh, uh oh, they're training. They're switching to Victory Bell. On my blue version, before I got my capture card, I played uh, blue, like my walkthrough or whatever. Um, and yeah, I had a Victory Bell on my team, and it was beast, I'm not gonna lie. So in the anime, James had one, and that was a pretty good Pokemon. <clears throat> we are poison, no. All right, um, dang. Don't you just hate it when those attacks continue? Oh, we're hurt by poison doesn't help. Oh no, Dragonair, no. All right, man, who will avenge Dragonair's death? I guess Pikachu, you gotta do it, boy. All right, Thunderbolt action. I got some uh, Marley coffee with me. It is delicious. Mmm. Very good. <laughs> yeah, man. Life has been great. We are just escaping through the world of Pokemon, and it is awesome. And Thunderbolt action here. Yes, okay, so finally, the Weeping Bell is taken out and we still because I guess they switch this trainer is the only trainer I think throughout this whole entire walkthrough that I've seen switch their Pokemon like this um, so this is pretty uh, interesting <clears throat> we, uh, Victory Bell is finally out of here alright we defeated the train <coughs> that trainer ooh level 54 Pikachu alright Pikachu way to get up there in the ranks I'm furious are you fast? No? Alright. Well, uh, you're not gonna talk to me, huh? Alright. I guess, uh, I guess we'll truck on out of here. Man, these trainers are rude on this, uh, victory road here. I tell ya. They get mad when they lose. They get hot-tempered. They need to learn to respect their elders, man. I mean, we are an 11-year-old kid, right? 10, 11? So, I guess... We're not really elderly. I mean, I guess I'm like, what, 28? So, <laughs> I feel like an old man. All right. <laughs> we gotta push this boulder down the hole. Let's watch it go, Wee! All right, man. Do you hear that loud noise, Pikachu? Let's, should we go down there? Should we risk our life? Jump down the hole? All right, let's do it. Ah! Boom! Oh, luckily you didn't land on- Sorry I landed on you, Pikachu. Luckily you didn't land on the rock. Man. Alright. Boulder! Goro. Or Goro. Why do I always- It's like my Pokemon. I always forget how I pronounce it. Goro is for Mortal Kombat. I, I think I mentioned that before. Uh, don't know why I'm repeating myself. But hey. We're, uh, taking our rock. And we're rolling. Yeah. Bad joke, I know, I get it. Um, <laughs> Alright, man, I can't wait till we put it on the Switch! Literally, I can't wait till we put the Pokemon game on the Switch. Um, here we go. Bam! Ah, so you wish to challenge the Elite Four! Yes. Does that mean I have to go through you, man? Are you the last trainer on Victory Road? Dang, you got four Pokemon? Dang, bro. Drowsy. I think that's a very popular Pokemon in Japan. He's very creepy. I'm surprised they haven't made like a uh, dream eating. You know how like they make those dream eaters or those dream sorry dream catchers. Uh, they should make one like in Drowsy. Like if they could, in the web kind of put the face of Drowsy in there, that'd be kind of cool. I, I would imagine like Pokemon Center would be able to sell that. It's like man, if you have nightmares. Let Drowsy eat him for you, you know? <laughs> Alright, and now Juggler is about to send in Hypno. Alright. Hypno is kind of scary too. He could like uh, 
brainwash you, basically, like, hypnotize you. So imagine if you were his trainer and then one day a drowsy just turns on you, hypni hypnotizes you, and you're living a whole nother life for a couple months. <laughs> Dang, that'd be crazy. Alright, so Bolda is almost doing the job, but, ugh, taking a beating, 34 HP left. Alright, come on, baby. Earthquake. Oh, we get hit with the poison gas. And now we are poisoned, of course. All these trainers, that's like their tactic. They like to poison us. Because they can't really win. Come on. And, and, and I see a lot of paralyzing, too. So, yeah, man. Gotta try, gotta try a new strategy here, bro. Alright, so... Looks like... It's not looking good for Boulder. It's just not. I'm sorry, Boulder. You tried, bro. We will avenge your your, your fate. With Bradley. Alright, Bradley. So we do have Skull Bash on Squirtle. So I'm, now I make sense why we got rid of it. Why we tossed it in the other video. It's like we already have a Pokemon that has it, so. I feel like Squirtle's like any turtle Pokemon really would probably that probably be good for Skull Bash. All right, look at all that XP. Kadabra's coming in. Forty level forty one Kadabra. Surf action. Speaking of uh, Squirtle, I heard um, when you download Pokemon Home for the Switch, um, you get a free Pokemon. You get to choose like out of all the starters of the uh, uh, Kanto. So that is uh, that's pretty cool. You know who I'm choosing, of course. I wouldn't mind another Squirtle. Supposedly it has a hidden ability. So. I don't think any of my Pokemon have hidden abilities, unless I don't know how to check for that. <laughs> but, um, yeah, man. Katapra is out of here. Yeah. One more Pokemon, baby. One more Pokemon. Juggler sent out Katapra. Alright, come on, Pikachu. One hit KO, baby. Do it for me. Aw, oh, that's alright. You did, you did pretty good damage. Oh, this Kadabra had to do recover. Really, bro? Really? Alright, come on, Pikachu. Hurt by poison. Come on, don't faint on us. I can't bear to hear your cry all the time, man. No! Why? You evil Kadabra! You're evil! Alright, Scyther, come on. Cut him down to size. Yeah! Now we out of here. Alright, we go to level 43. We're moving on up, y'all. You got me! 1435, huh? Alrighty. Ooh, and we are out of this cave. Yes, we have to go heal up right now. Pikachu is fainted. We got some Pokemon. We got like two Pokemon, right? I think it's just Scyther and Bol uh, Boulder. Or is it Goro? I don't remember. Um, yeah, man. We are finally here, though, at the Pokemon League. We're not going to be here long because we just have to heal. We have to go train some more Pokemon, but the training part of the video is very short, so no worries. Next video, we will be challenge challenging the Elite Four, so I hope you guys are ready. I can't wait. I've been waiting for this moment since we started. This is awesome. I love challenging the Elite Four. Alright, we hope to see you again. Let's go, Pikachu! Here we go, cutting to the, the training. Look at 
Zitz is already at level 55. That's crazy. Uh oh. I know what we're doing. Okay, so we got six rare candies. We're gonna use it on Dragonair. He's already 51. Alright. 52. 53. Come on, two more levels and we evolved to Dragonite, baby. <clears throat> 54. One more. Let's get it. Dragonite. Come on, baby. Woo, yeah. <clears throat> Got to drink some coffee, man. All right, <laughs> my voice is getting all crackly. All right, so we're gonna get rid of a move. Probably Thunder Wave, right? Thunder Wave, Thunder Wave just paralyzes. Um, oh, nope, I was mistaken. Rap. All right, so we forgot how to rap. And Dragonair learned Hyper Beam. All right, what? Dragonair is evolving. Yeah, baby. Dragonite. We got us a Dragonite. <clears throat> yeah. That's awesome. Alright, baby. Level 56. Might as well give him our last rare candy. Alright. Let's look at the Pokedex. Now it says, Seen and Own 151 Pokemon. Ah. Yes, glorious. We have every single Pokemon in the Pokedex. Until Gen 2. <laughs> Alright. Um, but yeah, man. We got him. Let's go do this thing. Catch y'all in the next one. I want to say thank you for watching. And if you're a new viewer, please quick attack that like button and that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. Leave a comment down below to let me know you're real. And I'll see you next time. And until next time, trainers, keep on training.